right, Caitlin Simone is back, camera girl, and uh, she's going to be taking some extra footage for her second camera, and uh, uh, let's see how this works out for this one. Today, we're going to be working on the oil pump. I think this is why this whole motorcycle exploded in the first place. Looks like there's uh, three uh, screws in here. One, two, three. I can get those out. No, I'll do it, honey. Don't think they're quite strong enough yet. Wait, wait, do I talk? <laughs> you can make important comments if you need to. Okay. Are you pointing at what I'm working on, or are we just floating around? All right. Let's see. What does an oil pump do, Caitlin? It pumps through the system, and then a and 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 it electrifies the motorcycle to go. Okay. You're close. An oil pump pumps oil. Does that make sense? Yeah, which is sending the gas to come in there. To make it go faster? Yeah. Yep. So you can go like this. That's right. Are we pointing the camera at what I'm doing? All right. Okay. You're doing good. Thank you. Get the screw out. Oh, there it came out. Okay, so three screws came out. Oh, what is that great horror? What is that? I don't know. I haven't figured it out yet. Are you pointing the camera at it? Yeah. So we have the hose. I think this whole thing just lifts up. Oh, there it goes. It came out. Yep. There. And then you can pull the hose out. There we go. Whoa. So that's our first look inside there, Caitlin. Are you getting a good shot? Yep. Good aim. All right. And we have a drive gear here. Which is uh, thicker on one end and skinnier on the other. Which causes it to uh, pulse up and down. Um, can you please wash your hands? No. So, I was hoping that I would find something broken in here. Are you watching me here, Caitlin? Hmm. Bummer. Ah. What do we have here? Rust! Ugh! No, I think that's grease. Ew, don't point it at me! And here it comes. Alright. I won. If that gets on my shirt, I'll be totally mad. Mad, mad, mad. Hmm. So my grandpa is watching that. Yeah. Getting all the grease out of there. Yeah, that is totally icky. Put some more grease back in there, though. Some yeah. Blue grease. So, be yeah. Wait a minute. I I'm allowed to talk through the video? Are you getting the picture? Yeah. Well, you can talk a little bit. Does that look like it's going to work? Wait a minute. Hold up. Hold Let up. me try it. Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. Oh, yes. You think it'll work? All right. Uh, blah, blah. Ah. That 
That's good. My hands smell gross. Ugh. I'm so glad that I don't. Are you getting a shot? Yes. What, that black stuff? Yep, that's grease. It smells horrible. <coughs> all right, that's all we're gonna do with this thing. There's a shaft. Maybe I'll clean this out. That is the spring? Nope, nope, that's all there is to it, hon. So, yeah, this is going to be pretty easy, uh, right? This part, I think, will be. Five minutes left. Oh, you have six minutes. Getting a shot, Caitlin? Yep. Totally. You like me and my camera, girl? Yeah. This camera, being a camera girl, is not bad. Hey. Wait a minute. The blue light is blinking. What does that mean? I think it means you're recording. That wind is so good. Are you getting a shot, honey? Yeah. Six minutes. Seven minutes. Screw is not going in. Oh, I am strong. Can I show my, the fan, my Barbie, please? <laughs> no, we're working on the Vespa. Oh, right. A little Barbie time here. You getting a shot? Yeah. Can you see the screw going in? Yeah. I kind of want to run my bag right now, but I can't. Not quite yet. Sounds like you're bored. Yes, so. Okay, let me finish screwing this in, and then you can go ride your bike. I'm not coming with you. I'll just walk it down. That's what I'll do. I'll you walk it down. you have air in the tires? You're going to have to put air in the tires. Eight minutes. You have eight minutes. Oh, sorry. Well, that's back in there. Let's see if it pumps. Yeah, we need the pump. Pump it up. Pump it up. Pump it up. Pump it up. Do I just go over there? No. <coughs> Can I do Don't it? Stand in front of the other camera, hug. Right there, this guy's got to see me. All right. Got the shaft out of the bike. Goes in the pump here. And should. Fingers oh, crossed. Yeah. Fingers crossed, everyone. I hope that this works. Right? This does not feel right. Yeah. What's going on? I don't know what's going on, kiddo. I'm going to take it back apart. Oh, but you just worked on that. I know. I didn't do it right, apparently. Oh, maybe I need to do this. Uh, that's what my problem is. My linkage got jammed. Look, a, a camera girl needs to take a break. Can I take a break? You can take a break. Oh, good. 
think. And I'm going to take a break. Can I? Yes, go. Oh. Don't let me stop you. I do have oil coming out the hole here. Not as much as I was hoping for. I am going to have to do more research and look into this oil pump deal. one bad idea left. Get back in there. In the air box. Oh, you need the oil pump shaft. Don't forget that. The oil pump shaft in here. Air box. I found out that the uh, oil pump is connected to the carburetor and uh, when I tested the oil pump earlier um, it did work properly so I'm leaving it alone That's what the little rubber gasket's for there, so you can adjust the mixture screw. Well, they don't make that easy to get to, do they? Okay. Feels about right. You need to use these fancy long nuts on here.
All right. So we got that installed. Okay, so this is the throttle. So this is gonna be hard for you to see. I guess I'll try and get you in here. Hook this hook here back to that guy there. That hook onto this lever. Hmm. I wonder if I should have done that before I uh, tightened down the carburetor. It's the order of things, I'm telling you. Got it right here. Hook right in here. Now the throttle cable can hook in here. It pulls them both at the same time in the same direction. Jam that in there. Alright, I have a problem. This is not to the reach. Well, what the hell? I ah, thought this was going to be easy. Boy, I am hitting one dead end after another tonight. I'm telling you. I don't even know if I can put together a complete comprehensive video about any damn thing. <laughs> it's pretty bad. I do think I want to put the cover on here before I run these cables. Otherwise, I'm going to have a problem getting the cover on. So let's see if we can just do that task without running into another issue here. That's in the right spot. I gotta find the screw for it. And this guy goes under here. I do not know where the screws are for that. Before I forget to do it. Choke seems to work all right. Good. 
I bought a new gasket kit for the airbox. So that's coming. I just gotta figure out why I'm coming up so short with the throttle cable. I mean, it's just way off by a good half an inch. Short. You little shit. Now, yeah, I could pull this and make it hook, but then I'd be giving it throttle. It would screw up my idle t speed, wouldn't it? It's a lot of throttle. A lot of throttle to get that cable to hook. Alright, you can see I have the throttle cable hooked up here properly. It does have a slightly larger gap than I wanted it to. But the reason I didn't have the slack I wanted was because up on the handlebar here, there is a nylon bushing right here. You can't see. Right there, that little white nylon bushing right there. This is the other end of the throttle cable. That popped out and was sitting crooked in the hole. So long as I got that popped back in line, everything uh, went together quite nicely after that. So good. That means I can reassemble the front of the bike. But before I do that, I want to put a battery in here and uh, test the lights to see what lights come on. All right, let's install the battery. Okay. Plus, minus. So, terminal's out, I would say, so why not? I'll cross them after. Oh, yeah, yeah, caramba! Right. Okay. That clearly just goes to ground. Blue. Yeah, I like to try to get a second bite on that. Yeah. I have no idea if the turn signals work or anything like that. I guess they do. We did test them, didn't we? I don't know if the back ones work. You gotta know, put covers on to see. That one's a little jammed up. I have not put this battery on the charger. The directions don't say anything about charging it. So I didn't charge it. Right. 
not done put the spare tire on yet. I want to verify how this stuff works. Let's see what happens here. Turn the key on. A green neutral light, so that means the neutral safety is working. I can button that up. Cool. I have a brake light, but I think that's because the uh, side covers on either side are off, which means there's no turn signals, so you get a, a bright brake light. So, alright. Everybody's got to push the horn. Got nothing on the horn. I got nothing on the headlight either. So, we're going to leave the headlight on low, and we are going to go to turn this blink. So, all right, call it in the wind, turn it off. So now, I'm going to put the head together. All right, I've decided not to put the bike back together. Scooter says it's time to wrap things up. I have some loose ends I need to tie up on the engine and the battery side and some wiring I need to do. And you can't tell if this headlight works unless the engine is running. So I want to get the engine running, but I can't do that until I do all this other crap. So I'm going to end the video here. And uh, the next video, I think we're going to be able to get this thing to run. So thanks for watching. Hit the subscribe button. Give me a thumbs up, thumbs down. Leave a comment. Let me know what you think. I really do appreciate it. And as usual, have a good day. Bye-bye. Are you done? Not the shit off, honey. <laughs>